What's going on guys? Back with the Map 13 video. Please do me a favor, hit that like button, try to get every video up over 100, 150. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Comment on the video if you feel so inclined. And last but not least, you can follow me on Twitter with the username Shutdown Safety. Before I get into the video today, I want to play you a clip from the Madden 13 playbook. It talks about what the Infinity Engine is going to bring to the gameplay in Madden 13. Hey, I'm here with Victor Lugo, gameplay designer for Madden NFL 13. I'm telling you, you put this game on and this thing looks real. It's so authentic and everybody's talking about the new Infinity Engine. Tell me about it. Well, the Infinity Engine uh, alludes to the, limited to the limitless possibilities that we have in this game now due to this engine. It is an animation-driven uh, physics engine which augments every single animation in the game uh, in a realistic manner. So every animation that you thought you would have noticed or recognized is now completely different because of the interaction that happens between people. You'll see legs flailing realistically. You'll see more momentum conserved. You'll see players flying off the line much more realistically. And yeah. I'm really looking forward to, to showing people. Well, we talk about reactions, you know, actions, reactions. We talk about guys hitting, you know, I mean, these two guys flying around the football field, smacking people, call them snot bubble hits, right? Yes. Yeah, now this bubbles, game right. actually shows exactly what's going on with the reaction that you have from those hits and the way bodies actually work. Right. Well, uh, you know, at, at the, the basic level, force equals, equals mass time acceleration, we're talking about big guys hitting each other really, really hard. And we want to reflect that in the game. So if, I'm, if you uh, give me a second, I'm going to show you a quick right. video that reflects exactly what we're talking okay. about. Okay. So here's a quick comparison of Madden NFL 12 versus 13. So as you can see on this hit, this is a good animation, uh, but we've improved it. But let me, let me point some things out to you real okay. quick. So as you see these guys hit each other, you notice that there's an invisible wall here who kind of stops and we've lined them up really well but they kind of don't stop look at the line that the guy's standing on when he falls right also you'll observe that this leg goes through and you'll observe that the arms actually interpenetrate as well now let's look at Madden NFL 13 this guy's flying way over here right you can see the momentum actually that didn't happen across before the screen right exactly so momentum is conserved as it always should be he's gonna fly way over here look at that leg didn't go through. He's pushing that leg. Right. That's exactly what should happen. If I push your leg, you're going to move. Same with the arm. It no longer goes through. So that's the type of realism and that's the type of variety that we're going to carry over to all of our plays and all of our interactions that happen in the game. And that's going to make it really, really emergent and feel really organic and, and alive. Okay, so there you basically saw things that have plagued this franchise forever. He talked about the invisible wall that comes up when an animation starts, the leg and arm shifting that we've all spoke about, but most importantly, he talks about the Infinity Engine ridding the game of that. He says that this no longer has a situation where the arm and the leg go through, momentum gets carried, and most importantly, he says that that's the type of realism and variety that we are going to carry over to all our plays and all of our interactions that happen in the game. And you know what? It's very important for you to realize that when people People watch these videos they do so to make a determination of whether they're gonna purchase the game or not and they take those videos as factual as they can because if nothing else they're being used to promote the game so as I play this for you at speed I just want you to take a note of what exactly happens here in my online franchise when Jonathan Vilma goes through an interaction between Daryl Tapp and a lineman these two players morph through each other 100%. There is no animation that the game has to signify a broken interaction between tap, Vilma, and the left tackle. So the only thing it can do is shift my two linebackers through each other. And what happens in this animation shift is tap is actually forcing the offensive lineman back, the tackle there, into the guard. And what this does is basically create an untouched lane that I can go through. And even though the ball is ironically thrown immediately before I get to the quarterback, I want you to just see how flawed something like this is when you still have warping and shifting in the game. You see the left guard is actually responsible for Vilma because he recognizes him right there with procedural awareness, which I like. He then tries to get over at an angle at which he's going to be able to block, which is realistic, although I think the guard should maybe move a little bit faster in this scenario. We do have Vilma running at full speed, so I understand that. But as he goes to run back to protect the quarterback, this is when the shift occurs. And this is what sends the players 
all out of order with each other. And I want you to notice that all these players do shift through each other. When that tackle goes back, he shifts into that left guard. Their legs actually intertwine through each other down here. So there isn't a situation where you can say everything physically got respected. And as I said, you know, this is something that actually still happens in this game. It's still prevalent, still impacts plays on a every game basis. Yet we were told in the marketing that it would no longer be in the game. I'd like to know your guys' opinions on this. And I'll be back in the week with more videos.